Are you all sitting comfortably? We're going to do a short quiz called "What kind of student are you?" I want you to listen carefully and think about your responses. Then I want you to write your answers in your notebook. Please be sincere. Nobody is going to look at your answers. When we complete the quiz, I'll read out the results, and you can think about them carefully for a few minutes in private. You need a pen and a blank page in your notebook. Okay, pay attention, please. One. When do you usually get to school? A. Early. You like to have extra time just in case something crops up. B. You always turn up just in time as the bell rings. C. You often get to school late, out of breath from rushing. Two. When do you usually do your homework? A. As soon as you get it, the same evening. B. A day or two before you have to hand it in. C. The same day you hand it in. Sometimes it's late. Three. What is your average mark in tests? A. You usually do well and get seventy-five percent or higher. B. You usually pass tests, but your marks are near to fifty or sixty percent. C. Your marks are often below fifty percent. Four. What kind of relationship do you have with the staff at school? A. Great. You get on well with most of the academic staff. B. Not bad. You have a good relationship with some members of staff. C. Dreadful. In general, you don't get on with teachers. Five. Where do you usually sit in class? A. Usually at the front, so that you can see the board easily. B. Somewhere near the middle, so you can daydream unnoticed. C. Near the back, so you can turn on your mobile without being seen. Six. What do you want to do when you finish school? A. Carry on studying at university or college. B. You don't know yet. It depends on your exam results. C. Look for a job and start earning your own money. You'll be fed up with studying by then. Okay. Now, look at your answers and count the number of A's, B's, and C's. And then I'll read out the results. Are you ready? If you have mostly A's, you are an exceptional student. You are mature, and you have a superb attitude towards your studies. You definitely grasp the importance of a good education. If you have mostly B's, you are an average student. But you are capable of much more, and it isn't too late to improve and become an excellent student. You just need to make a few changes to your habits. If you have mostly C's, you really need to adjust your outlook. You waste your time, and you are at risk of finishing school without any qualifications. Think about your behaviour and consider making some changes before it's too late.